called. We just I just talked to him to try to settle in because we were running plays that I've never diagrammed before, so it was quite interesting. Um, so once we just kind of settled down, I thought that we started to play our game, and then I was running some stupid defenses early on that I went away from and just went back to man to man. And once we did that, I thought that our pressure uh, really stepped it up to help with our transition game. The Weber girl, the Pot girl, the Meyer girl—they've got a lot of weapons. You can kind of talk about just some of the. Challenges are, you know, playing them, but also playing them for the third time. Follow through on a game plan. Mm -hmm. You know, obviously we give them, we give them all their strengths and weaknesses of every player. Um, it's no different. That's what I'll have ready tomorrow morning. I'm going to watch hours of film, and that's part of it. Um, you know, I expect our girls to be able to carry that out. You know, it's just like doing your homework uh, with school, and this won't be any different. So, um, you know, our girls did a fabulous job on the defensive side. I don't, I'm not sure what all of those girls finished with. Uh, Kayla, but I know it wasn't very many. So, you know, we were we contested a lot of shots tonight, and that led into our transition. Coach, going inside to Sophia Pfeffer, was, was that something, that was a game plan coming in or you just recognized? Yeah, you know, they, they, what they were running, uh, Thomas, they were running a triangle and two on Mara and Maggie, and it's something, I'm not going to lie to you, we prepared for that for 48 hours, so I was really glad that they did that. Uh, because I, if Sophia comes ready to play, I think she's a pretty special basketball player. And tonight, she really stepped it up. You know, she was getting banged around in there. I love it how the officials called it uh, because they let them play. Um, you know, and Sophia demanded the ball, and she wasn't about to kick it out. And when you finish with uh, 37 points with a career high, uh, that says quite a bit about what she did tonight. So, and she'll be the first one to tell you, it started with her defense. She started getting steals and creating things for other people, and that kind of gets her going. Really got going when you started the trap, too, in the half court. Yep, thought. yes. Uh, and you know, ball screens, we like it when teams set ball screens. That gives us the opportunity to do our thing. and. Uh, you know, tonight was, and we, we just started to rotate. I didn't think our rotation early on was very good. Um, so, you know, it's just things that we've worked on, and it was good to see them fall through with a game plan for at least three quarters. Yeah, that mid second to mid third, that's pretty tough. I mean, you're pretty tough to beat yep. when you play like that. Yeah, you know, and like it, it all started like Tom said, you know, just getting the ball inside. Uh, I think if we, if we do that, and they're not double teaming down there. Um, you have to continue to do that. And Keely was doing the same thing. How she made some of those shots, I don't know, because uh, it looked like she's getting banged around. But, you know, she might be 5'8", but I guarantee her, you know, Sophia's only 5'10". They play bigger than that. Uh, and they're going to have to, obviously, going into Monday. I, I, we know that. Do you know who won yet? No. Not a clue. No. Nope.